I was very um, I was very scared about the idea to be honest, and that's why people ask me a lot throughout Westlife why why you know do I do a solo album, and I'm like no, I'm like I'm in Westlife. Why would I want to do a solo album? You know, you're one of the biggest bands in the world, but when we decided to, to split as a band, it was something then if I wanted to sing on you, I have to go solo. Um, and I kind of, it kind of pushed me into the decision, but it was not a hard decision. But it was, a, I was still very scared, you know. It was one of those things you had to take a while to get used to it. And the only way to get used to something is to do it, you know. And you just got to do it. It's just like the song right now. I was very nervous about that because I'd never done it really before. Like not much, you know. And I kind of got thrown in the deep end into the swimming pool, and I had to learn how to swim, you know. And that's something how you just got to do it, you know. At the start of Westlife. We didn't know what to expect either, we just did it and, then, and it was great, you know, we didn't expect anything. So, now with my soul for now, I, I don't expect, I, I've no expectations beyond, you know, hopefully people will like my music, you know, that's all I want to get. If I get that and hopefully build on it, I know it's going to take time, you know, we're going to have to work very hard. And there's a lot of very good solo artists in the world at the moment, but i, I got to focus on, on Shane Pilot, you know, I can't focus on anybody else. What are the software things So, I think, um, you know, just, I suppose, being out there on your own, you know, actually throwing the world on your own, it's very different, you know, it's, it's very, just the thought of it scared me a little bit, you know, and I didn't know what to expect, um, but again, you know, you have to do it, you know, I've got three young children, I've got a wife, and I, I gotta, I gotta go out and earn a living, you know, and that's my job, you know, my wife is amazing, she looks after my kids, brings them to school every day, and she's there now very busy, and I'm in Manila very busy, and my job is, is to take care of them, so, I get to sing, it's, it's a pretty cool job to have to be, you know, this is pretty cool, so, you know, it's, it's amazing so far. Are you working with any, any team from Westlife, like the band? Um, the only person from Westlife, well, obviously, I have the same manager. My manager, Louis Walsh, is my, is my manager. He managed Westlife. Um, I've got the same kind of management team and management structure and business people that are looking after Westlife. Um, but obviously, Liam is a new person, full manager on the road, he's my day-to-day person. He's new, so he's my new friend on the road, traveling all over the world. So it's only two of us, so it's pretty cool, you know, because it's quite easy to do everything. Um, you know, you, you make a decision in two seconds, like, do you want to do that? Yeah, okay. It's not like a, a big debate, you know, so it's, that's probably the easiest thing about being solo. Um, everything is done quite quickly. Um, but yeah, everything else, all the musicians, all the producers are all new bar, one, one people, uh, Steve Mack and Wayne Hexen, who goes flying without wings, and, you know, squared again, world of their own, what makes a man. Half of our West I did. I got to write with them, which was amazing. I know I'm very close to them, I'm very good friends with them. Um, so we wrote my new single, About You, which is the video is on uh, YouTube on Monday. I think. So it's a really good song, good video. Last question. Uh, I read somewhere that you were doing with Kenny now. From MVP. Well, Kenny, well, I think, I think a lot of people are going to compare me to lots of different people. Um, you know, Ronan Keaton, obviously, he's, he's had a great sort of career. I know Ronan quite well done very well for yourself. But I think we're very different. I think vocally we're different. I think musically we're different. Um, you know, and I think same with Michael Bublé, same with Bruno Mars, Justin Timberlake, whoever. You know, we're all very different. I don't sing like any of them and they don't sing like me, you know, and it's, that's what I think is individual, you know. And, but my music I think is slightly different too, you know. I think it's very different to Justin Timberlake, obviously, and Michael Bublé. It's all, we all, I suppose, have to carve out your own sound and your own career. And, you know, they're big stars. I'm only starting. I'm only like early days, you know, so. Hopefully in a few years, people will try not to be like my family, you know, and hopefully, you know, get successful.